The knee joint is a conglomerate joint and also known as the tibiofemoral joint. It consists of the femur, the patella, and the tibia. It also contains two menisci, a medial and a lateral um, bursa, as well as four ligaments, the ACL, the PCL, the LCL, and the MCL. Um, it can flex, or it extends at 180 degrees and it can flex up to 140 degrees. Knee flexion and extension occur in the sagittal plane. There are five knee extensors. The vastus intermediates originates on the proximal neck and shaft of the femur and insert on the tibial tuberosity. The vastus medialis originates on the lesser trochanter of the femur and inserts on the tibial tuberosity. The vastus lateralis originates on the greater trochanter of the femur and inserts on the tibial tuberosity. The rectus femoris originates on the ASIS and inserts on the tibial tuberosity. The sartorius originates on the ASIS and inserts on the pes anterior. The popliteus is the only true flexor of the knee. It originates on the medial femoral condyle and inserts on the proximal tibia. The soleus is superficial to the popliteus. It originates on the gastrocnemius and inserts on the calcaneus. The gastrocnemius originates on the femoral epicondyles and inserts on the calcaneus. The semitendinosus originates on the ischial tuberosity and inserts on the pes anserine. The semimembranosus originates on the ischial tuberosity and inserts on the medial femoral epicondyle. The bicep femoris originates on the ischial tuberosity and inserts on the lateral femoral condyle. Here the patient is performing a jumping motion, which involves flexion of the knee, then extension of the knee, and then flexion upon landing to absorb the ground reaction forces. Here the patient is performing a walking motion. Walking is the most common method of knee flexion and extension in everyday life. The knee is fully extended during the heel strike phase and then begins to flex during the toe off phase of gait. When the patient begins to run, the mechanics of knee flexion and extension change. There is a new phase added to gait, the flight phase, which impedes the knee from fully extending.